Beloved business owners, have you ever been asked for a profit and loss statement and you were thinking to yourself, hmm, what the heck is that? I'm going to explain to you exactly what it is. I am Niall Carter-Gray, owner and founder of First Step Accounting, where we make accounting a little less taxing. And I am so excited today to run down the profit and loss statement. The profit and loss statement is what I like to call the current year's progress report. It showcases your business's income as well as the expenses that have gone out. Not only will you need this report for tax compliance purposes, but you'll also need it to manage your business financially. Now, the profit profit and loss statement is broken down into a few different buckets. The first portion of the profit and loss statement is your income. This is the money you receive from your customers and your clients for the goods and services that you sell, minus any refunds or discounts that you offer them. The second portion of the profit and loss statement is of the cost of goods sold. If you produce or manufacture goods, this is where you will record the cost of those items that you need in order to make those goods. So for example, if you're a candle maker and you had to buy wax or wicks in order to make your candles, these will be considered cost of goods sold. Next up are expenses. Expenses are the items you have to pay for that are ordinary and necessary to run your business. So think these are the day-to-day -day costs. If you're renting an outside office it would include things such as rent and utilities it can also include things such as advertising expenses or those dues and subscriptions for your software and lastly on the profit and loss statement is your other income and other expenses these are the non-traditional income sources or expenses that may not be uh, cash based uh, that also impact your bottom line so think of interest income or depreciation and amortization. What's left over after you take your income, minus your cost of goods sold, minus your expenses, plus your other income, and minus your other expenses is your net profit. This is what you're going to use in order to determine what your taxable income is and to see how well or how bad, unfortunately, your business is doing. Stay tuned for more tips and information on how you can manage your business.